it's time for another awesome workout with Angela. If you're enjoying the five color fitness workouts, remember to subscribe for weekly fitness videos. Click the link above for more workouts with jeans with Angela. Hi, it's Angela. Welcome back to five color fitness. Today's workout is going to be a little bit of standing work and then we're going to head down to the floor. No equipment necessary, just you and lots of energy. Okay, let's get to it. All right, let's start with some stretches, parallel feet together. We're gonna take a very square arm out to the side and just reach up the chest, pull the elbows back and really open it out. It feels really good on the chest, really good on the upper back. Hold it there and then lift up tall. Grab one wrist, pull the wrist up and you're gonna reach over to the side. Get a big side stretch, just hold the stretch. Lengthen out, really reach to the opposite side and we'll come through the center to switch. Switch the hand grip, reach over to the opposite side, really stretch it out, good, hold it, breathe, pull away, and come on up. So we're gonna repeat that, but we're gonna switch with a little leg twist. So cross the leg over, grab the wrist, ground the feet, and reach over. You really feel that hip and that side body stretching. Hold it and breathe, good. And then we'll do the other side. Switch the leg in front, Switch the arm grip, reach up, reach over, breathe and hold it, really lengthen the chest and come on up. Okay, let's go for some narrow squats to warm up. 10 narrow squats up, good. Nine, lift, eight, up, good. Seven, good, six, good, five, really bend, four, and three, Good, nice, lift the chest, two, good, and one. Now we're gonna take some lunges back. We're gonna lunge back, 10, come on up. So we're gonna bend both knees, toe hits the ground in the back, nine, and eight, good. Keep that chest lifted for balance. Seven, good, six, you got it, five, keep it going, four, and three, good, and two, and one, now hold this one back. We're gonna reach the arms up, extend the back leg. We're gonna fly the body forward, put weight forward, and then lift it up, eight. Fly the body forward, lift it up, seven. Use that front leg to really bend low to the ground. Good, six, reach it up, reach it back, five, good. Reach it up, reach it back, four. Nice long lift to the top, good. Reach it up, good, two more. Reach it up, one more, lengthen forward, reach it up, good. We're gonna lift the knee and reach it back. Again, lift the knee and reach it back. Use those arms to extend up, it'll help you balance. Really lift them up, good. Four, we're gonna do two, eight. And five, take it back, good. And six, take it back. And seven, reach, one more eight and back okay switching legs we're going to take the opposite leg back bring those arms up again we're going to fly forward on the opposite foot and reach it up good really shift the body weight over that front leg and lift up i'm staying low to the ground fly it forward this is three we're doing eight reach up fly it forward four and reach up keep breathing and nice long reach, good, and fly down. We've got two more after this one. Reach and lengthen, long chest, good. One more, reach and lengthen. Okay, leave those arms up now. We shift that back knee up, tap it back. Lift it up, seven, reach, good. Six, good, I know that front leg is working hard. Five, good, lift, four, tap it back. Three, good, two, one more, one, good. Okay, bring the legs together. We're gonna do some side lunges. We're gonna bend the outside leg out, stretch the inside leg, push it back, then switch. Push it back, here's eight more, eight. Bring in the toes, seven. Bring the feet together, good, six. Shift in, five, good. So we're leaning forward a little bit, keeping the chest up though, four, Three, good, two, and one. Now we're gonna bring the hands behind the head. We're gonna do the same lunge out, but we add a knee twist. 
Same leg, lunge down, knee twist, good. Six more, so eight in total. Five, pull in, four, tap it in, three, tap it in, you got it, two, push it in, one, good, other side. Lunge out, opposite side, cross it, seven, cross it, good. Six, ready, pull that knee up, five, good, breathe, four, yes, don't forget to breathe, good, two more, good, one more, good job. Okay, take a quick second, breathe. We're gonna come forward towards our mat, and all your space, whatever you have, we're gonna do some planking. So there's a little variation. So we're gonna bend the knees, walk the hands down to the ground, walk the body forward and set up in a push-up plank. So hold the plank here, just really feel the ground underneath you, abs are lifted, glutes are squeezed in, ribs are closed. And then we're gonna reverse that by walking back, hang the head over for a second, bend the knees, roll the body up slowly, take a breath. Okay, we're gonna add a little twist to that. We're gonna roll out to that plank and we're gonna alternate knee to chest for 10 counts. Let's do it. So walking out, slow walk out, set up your plank and now knee to chest. 10, nine, breathing eight, good. Seven, six, really keep those abs in. Five, pull in four, lift the knee right in. Three, two, good. One, hold your plank. Bend the knees to walk your hands back. Hang for a second. Inhale to roll up. Take a breath, exhale. Okay, we're doing it again. This time the knee is gonna to go towards the inside elbow. 10 times. Let's go, walk it out. Take that plank, set it up. Here we go, knee to inside elbow. 10, switch, nine, breathing, eight. Take that twist over the chest. Good, six, you got it, five, breathe for four, three, two, one more, good, hold it to walk yourself back, hang over, inhale slowly, exhale at the top, okay, just one more, last one I promise, knee to outside elbow this time, 10 of those, okay, back to our plank, walk it down, Walk it forward, abs are in. Here we go, out for 10, for nine. Breathe eight, you got it, seven. Squeeze it in, six. Good, use that side body, five, four, three, two, one. And then we're gonna go down on the knees into a big child's pose. Sit back on the heels, reach the arms forward. Just take a big inhale and a big exhale. Good. And then slowly coming up, we're gonna come on the knees and the hands are gonna go underneath the chest, belly button to spine, so we're on all fours. We're gonna extend one leg and the opposite arm is gonna reach. We're gonna balance there and then we're gonna squeeze the knee into the outside elbow and the elbow into the side body and reach. So pretty open with the knee and the elbow. Good. And reach, three more to go. Squeeze, keeping those abs lifted. Reach it long. It's hard to balance here. So pull those abs up to the sky. One more and reach. Okay, other side. Extend the opposite leg, opposite arms. Get your balance. And then we're going to squeeze in and reach. Good. Four more and reach. Three more and reach. Nice long reach. Two more. You got it. Good. Keep those abs lifted. Good. One more, good, and come on down. So we're gonna slide the body forward, but keep the hands underneath the chest. And we're gonna slowly lower the body by brushing the elbows against the body. So using the triceps, lower all the way down. Then I'm gonna push all the way up the same way and just reach the glutes back. So we're gonna make that movement a little fluid. So we're gonna roll forward, keeping the abs in. Bend the elbows close, push the body up. Sit on back. You're really going to use those triceps for that movement. So really engage the back of the arms. Roll the body down. Push the arms. Sit on back. Two more to go. Nice and controlled. Abs are in. Drop down. Push up. Sit 
it on back. And then we're gonna slide all the way onto the stomach. Take your hands under the chest and give yourself a big stretch by pushing the body up. Hold the stretch, lift the torso, and then relax down. Okay, a little bit of work for the back of the hamstrings and the glutes. We're gonna lay on our hands. I'm gonna explain it first, and then we'll do it together. Knees open and toes are touching. My head is gonna be down. My abs are gonna pull in, and my hips are gonna lift up. So I'm gonna keep my hip bones down, but my glutes are gonna go up. So I'm gonna lift up for 10. Okay, let's do it together. 10, nine, eight, really squeezing the glutes, really squeezing the hamstrings, and four, and three, and two. Now hold it up and pulse, 10, nine, good, breathing, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and relax. Stretch the legs out, give them a little shimmy, and then we're gonna take the hands behind the lower back, Clasp the fingers together, push the feet into the ground, squeeze the legs together and keep them down, but lift the body up. So we're gonna reach back and lift. Looking straight ahead, don't lift the head up too high. And then we're gonna release down. Switch the grip so the weird thumb is on top. And we're gonna do the same thing. Push the legs down, lift the body up, look straight ahead and release down. Good, roll onto your back. We're gonna roll onto our backs, hug your knees in for a second. Give it a big squeeze. Good. And then come on down. So I'm gonna extend my one leg up and I'm gonna do some single leg bridges. If you need to bend this leg, that's fine. I'm gonna bridge up on that one glute and roll down. Bridge up and roll down. Bridge up and roll down. Bridge up and roll down, good. Keep going and roll down. We're gonna do four more and roll down. Three, roll down, two, and down. One more bridge, roll it down. I'm gonna take my hands behind my head, keep the leg there, and I'm gonna crunch up for 10. Good, keeping my abs in nine. Look towards the navel, eight, and seven. Pull it in, six, good, and five. Exhale, four, and three, and two. Now hold up number one, hold it there. We're gonna lower the leg and kick it up. Staying up in the torso, nine, kick it up. Eight, kick it up, really lift that chest up. Good, lift up in the abs, good. Kick it up, five more, down. Exhale up, good, four more, you got it. Pull it in, three, lift, two, Lift, one, lift, and let's switch legs. So the other leg will come up. Again, you can bend or stretch. We're gonna bridge on the opposite side. Push up and down, good. Push and down, up, eight, and seven, and six, good, and five, four, good, three, and two, and one, okay, again, 10 crunches with the opposite leg up, 10. Good, pulling in nine, eight, seven, good. Exhale, six, five, breathing, four, good. Three, two, hold it up. Now we're gonna lower and kick 10. Keep those head up, look at the belly button, nine, kick it down, eight, exhale, seven, lift. Six, good, pull it in, good, five, good, four, lift. We've got three more, stay up, I know it's hard. Two, kick, one, kick, and release. Okay, roll onto your side. We're gonna do some leg work on our side. So we're gonna come over on the elbow, bend the underneath leg. I'm gonna extend the top leg here, and my foot is very parallel. And five, long leg, four, Three, two, one. I'm gonna bend the knee to my chest, kick forward, bend the knee, kick back, eight. And reach forward, and reach back, seven, good. Stay nice and lifted, six, really breathe. You're gonna feel that burn out there, good. Push, good, four more. 
Nice, long reach through the heel. Three, good. And reach. Two, push. And reach. One, extend. And reach, good. Bending those knees, I'm gonna lay on down and I'm gonna twist into my waist. I'm gonna extend the top leg and I'm gonna crunch in with the knee. Extend eight. Crunch in, seven, good. Pull in, six. Come on in, five, good. Four, reach, three, good. Two, reach, one, reach. Okay, those are hard, right? Okay, let's do the other side. We're gonna do the whole other side. So we're gonna set up for that leg work first. Elbow down, knee is bent. I'm gonna extend and flex that top leg. Stay lifted in the torso. And we're gonna reach up eight. And seven, nice long legs. Six, good, stay lifted. Five, heel leads the way. Four, three, good, two, one. I'm gonna bend the knee, reach forward. Bend, reach straight back. That was eight, this is seven, good. Lengthen, pull in the abs, six, stay lifted on that side. And five, good, and reach. And four, and reach, good. You got three more sets, push it back, hang in, breathe, two, good. We're in it together, let's go. One, good job. Okay, same thing, bend knees, I'm gonna twist into the waist, pull the abs in, support my head, extend the leg, and pull the knee in as I crunch in eight. And seven, breathe it in, six, keeping the chin in. And five, and four, good. Three, extend, two, and one, good job. This time I'm gonna roll into my stomach, we're gonna do some big stretches to end. I'm gonna tuck my toes and push myself into a downward facing dog. So I'm making a triangle with my whole body, my hips are high, my back is as flat as I can make it. If you can't get your heels to reach the floor, don't worry about it, just try and get those legs nice and straight. And just take a deep breath here. It's quite an intense position. You just wanna hold it. Get a big stretch, it stretches every part of the body. Hold the stretch. And then if you wanna to try to lift one leg up, don't worry if it's not high, you do what feels good for you. You can lift that leg up, take a big stretch up. You can bend the knee, stretch the leg if you want, or just bend. And then we're gonna bring the knee to the chest, take the foot forward a little bit outside, of the hip. I'm gonna adjust myself. This is called a lizard lunge. My hands are next to the inside of my feet and I'm gonna hold it. Now, if this is great, this is a good stretch, go ahead, stay here. If you wanna go a little more intense, if you wanna go a little deeper, you can come down on the elbows and you can even drop the knee. So whichever position works for you is great. Let's just hold it, whatever variation you found that feels good and just hang out here, let everything stretch out, take a few deep breaths, try and relax into the stretch, and let's hold it. We work those legs, we work that body, let's give it a chance to stretch out. Good, take a few breaths, we'll hold it a little longer. Good. Then we're gonna put our hands down underneath the chest, tuck the back toe and push back into the downward facing dog. Okay, hold that for a second. We're gonna shift and switch to the opposite leg. So we wanna lift the other leg that we didn't use yet, bend the knee, stretch it, hold it. You can bend it again, just open out that hip, reach it, good. And then pull the knee to the chest and take it to the outside of the opposite hip. Again, if this is good, stay here. Don't move out of it, this stretch is enough for you. Otherwise, we can go a little more deeper and drop the elbows, hold that. And if you wanna, you can drop the knee too. And just breathe, again, we're gonna hold the stretch. Hang out here, take a second, good. Reach it forward, stay long in the chest. Breathe and hold, good. From there we're gonna come back up, tuck that back toe again, push into that downward facing dog. Hold the stretch, and now very slowly just bend the knees, walk the hands back towards the shins. Head is heavy, and if you want you can Grab behind your calves and hug yourself in, but my knees are bent, so it's more of a back stretch than a hamstring stretch. Good, hold it, hug yourself, give yourself a big squeeze, 
and then relax the arms. Roll your body up with an inhale through the nose, peel the spine up, feel nice and tall and lifted as you stack the spine nice and straight until you're standing tall. Well, we did it. We worked, we stretched. So glad you joined me. Don't forget to follow me at Antgresh and follow at FHA underscore Fitness Health Active. Cheers, guys. Have an amazing day. If you're enjoying the five color fitness workouts, remember to subscribe for weekly fitness videos. Click the link above for more workout routines with Angela.